Good morning, Be the Faith. Happy Tuesday, guys. Hold on one second. Gets a little dirty at times. I hope everybody's having a great day. I'm gonna wait and see if anybody hops on this morning. I did announce that I'm coming live. Um, and then I'm going to get started. So as you guys hop on, say, hey. So I know I am not talking to myself. Famous last words. Good morning. Good morning, Brianna. Oh, I have a good amount of you guys watching this morning. Good morning, Madison. Yay, I'm so excited. Good morning, Torello. <clears throat> I hope you guys are all having such a good morning. Um, it is very cold here. Very, very cold. Very cold. I know it's snowing some places, so we don't have snow, but it is, it is mighty chilly. All right. <clears throat> Wait a few more seconds, and then I'm going to get started. Good morning, Brittany. <clears throat> all right. So, good morning, Erica. I wanted to come on here this morning and chat all things last chance first glance party okay i'm going to do the very basics of this um good morning jackie this is something that um i have done in my personal business through the years um and i find it very beneficial for my business my customers find it very beneficial um and they love seeing the new stuff. They love the opportunity to see all the new stuff that's coming before um, it launches, okay? So you have to very strategically work this. That's why I'm doing this live rather than doing a post and telling you guys about it. Um, but I've kind of trialed and errored throughout the years, learned from Katie Lasseter um, some really good tips and tricks that I uh, did last July, last time we had a transition. And um, so I just wanna share those with you guys. So first of all, anyone who is on, does anybody have a last chance first glance party scheduled between now and the end of the month? Okay, we know that February 1st is a brand new catalog season, right? Out with the old, in with the new. Brand new catalog season starts February 1st. So that's my first question. Does anybody who is watching live have a scheduled last chance first glance party? My next thing, if you do not have a last chance first glance party scheduled, hey Alexandra, listen to me. I want you to go ahead and get one on the books, okay? I want you to do, awesome, Brianna, you have one, Brittany, you have one, perfect, perfect, perfect. So hopefully this helps you guys. Um, I want you to go ahead and get one on the books so if you do not have one scheduled, okay? So mine is this Saturday, okay? I went on Canva, uh, when did I do this, last month, and I, or it was the beginning of this month, can't remember, and I created a little, like, flyer to share with them, I shared it to my VIP page, and then I personally texted all of my people, okay, all of my people, meaning all of my VIPs, all of my local customers, I texted them, texted them, letting them know about this last chance first glance party, okay, with the details, so like I said, mine is Saturday, um, and then after Saturday, we have an, a full week and then it's the new catalog. So crazy, crazy, crazy. Okay. So like I said, pro tip, if you don't have one scheduled, schedule one. So hopefully this is going to help you guys out that do have one scheduled who are going to schedule one, but please do this for your business. It's really fun. It's really exciting for your customers to be able to do this. Um, I do not create a new group. I, Katie, I have a VIP page and my VIP page is where I leak all of the information for my people. Um, I share all of the stuff that is releasing. So you guys don't see a lot of stuff behind the scenes that I post and that I text my people. Um, but I post everything for my customers in that VIP page and I text them personally. Um, Alex, I am doing a virtual piece to this because some people can't come and I do have a lot of customers who are not um, local and I will share that. Let me write that down. I'm going to, I'm going to tell you guys how I'm doing it virtually for those who are non-local. Okay. But no, my, my party on Saturday is in person. It is in my house. Okay. 12 to two. Um, my customers love it. 
and it's so much fun. I'm I'm a I'm a home party person, and you can do it rotating too, to where you have it like a few hours, like three to four hours. You can do like an open house. I know Katie Lasseter does uh, hers like an open house. Uh, mine, I'm just doing 12 to 2. I'm pregnant. I don't want people coming in, in and out of my house all day long. Okay. So, with that being said, how does this start? Okay. So, I'm going to show you guys really quick. One thing I did not grab. Bailey, stop. All right. So, something that I have done <clears throat> since the very beginning of me being a consultant, um, since my very first home party, this is something that Chloe... Cox shared with me, my sponsor, y'all's Upline SSD. Um, <clears throat> when you have a home party, okay, listen to me. And I used to only do home parties. That's how I started my business. That's how I grew my business. Um, I had to teach myself with co when COVID happened how to have a successful online party. So just listen to me with the tips and tricks with a home party, okay? So these right here are like lap boards um, for lack of a better term. It is something that has a pouch that somebody can write on, okay? So what I do with home parties, and this is what I'm going to be doing Saturday, is, if, well, first of all, what is this? This is literally <clears throat> a three ring binder that is from the dollar store, okay? I asked them, and they, I, when I used to get these, they would have black, blue, and red, and I would ask them in the back if they had um, any black ones, make sure that there is a pocket, and I would literally cut off the front of the binder and the back of the binder, okay? It gives you two of these. So what I do when people get here, here is the <clears throat> fall winter product list sheet. Product list sheets are your best friends, okay? Listen to me, catalogs are expensive. I do not have the money to waste for people to be marking up catalogs, but these are very easy, very, very cheap compared to catalogs. <clears throat> fold them up. I put my, um, I have a stamp. I put my stamp on there and um, people can mark all of these up. So what I do, I have this ready to go. I will have this ready to go. Um, I reminded myself. <laughs> I hand these to every single person when they walk in. Okay. When they walk in my house, first of all, I'm saying, okay, what do you want to drink? Because I have, I'll have like little goodies. Um, I'll have little snacks and I'll have drinks and stuff for them. Um, but I will hand them uh, one of these with a pen and I will guide them to where they need to go first. It's probably going to be on my kitchen counter. And what I'm gonna have <clears throat> is this entire tub right here. And I've already gone through all the scents that are leaving. I made this on Canva last year. I kept it on this because I knew that I always have these last chance first glance parties, okay? Bye, 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 leaving at the end of this, after this month, okay? All of the scents that are leaving, <clears throat> testers that are leaving at the end of this month, I have marked them on the bottom just for my purposes. Last season I did red, this season I did a pink dot, just so I know. All of these scents that are in this bucket are leaving at the end of this month, okay? Why is this important? Because last year when I did this, people had scents that they did not want leaving and they, op they opened up club at my party, okay? If they did not open up club, then they definitely stocked up because majority of everything in the catalog right now is 10% off, okay? So, I will have this out, the bye bye bye. I have I will have several of these. I created these on Canva, the last chance. Um I will also have the list out of uh the warmers that are leaving. Good morning, Cassie. The warmers that are leaving, we have some oils that are leaving. RIP lavender oil. I'm still not well about that, but we have some really good stuff that's leaving. Let me go ahead and make a list of everything leaving so I don't forget to print that off. Everything leaving. Okay, perfect. I will have that in everybody's face, right? Okay, so everyone's getting this. What's so cool about these product list sheets, if you've never had a home party, my favorite part all of the scents are right here, and I tell people to write their name on this. They can keep this, mark it up, circle all the scents you love, star them, do whatever you want to do. This is yours. So when they're smelling these scents that are leaving, they can mark on there and make notes, right? Because this is their sheet. It's not a catalog. It's not expensive for me to 
throw this away or if they don't want to keep it okay so and actually what i'll probably do guys just so you guys know i will print off these last chance flyers and i'm also going to print off what's leaving and i'm going to print put both of those in here okay and i'll probably go ahead no it's on here i already have a qr code directly to cincy club okay so that's all going to be in there um to remind myself okay so i will also have i have done a really good job this is actually the only amount of product list sheets that i have left from the season um i've done a really good job of getting those in the mail getting those in people's hands and then i have four catalogs left okay this is what's going to be at the party majority of this catalog is 10 percent off people can look through them they can do whatever they want to with them because guess what february 1st they're gone okay so people can look through that they can see anything they want to order so at the very beginning that is what i'm doing i'm handing these out handing a pin to them getting drinks in their hands, getting snacks in their hands, letting them all chit chat because they all know each other. I, I have some people who just love home parties, okay? Um, if they don't know each other, they can get to know each other, talk about the scents, whatever. So that is what is going to start my party out. Um, so after that, once I collect orders, okay? So this starts at 12, I will be collecting orders for fall, winter last chance orders for fall and winter okay i am not putting anything out that has to do with the new catalog during this time i will only have the testers of the stuff that is leaving probably some bars that are leaving um that i have on hand and then having them smell and look through uh stuff that's leaving okay after that i will collect orders i will let them know this worked very well last year I will let them know that they have time to place orders with me, okay? And here comes the fun part. So then I literally take everything away, everything away that is old, all of the fall winter stuff, all of the catalogs, all of the product sheets. Um, I have them put those away, okay? Because they've already made an order with me, which is PRV for this month. Thinking smarter, right? And then I bring out all of the new stuff and this is their favorite part, okay? my customers freaking love getting their their noses on the new smells okay they love getting to see what is coming in the new catalog so while i'm transitioning i do have a bar cart that is in my um in my kitchen and i haven't figured out when i'm doing it yet but i will be doing some type of giveaways okay this is not publicly it is stuff that I have on hand that is going to be leaving. So I have, I've already kind of pulled everything. I have some bars, I have some dryer discs, I have some counter clean, I have some um, Scentsy Soak. So these are, like I said, these are my VIPs that are coming to this party. I will be doing giveaways. They had so much fun with it last year. Like I said, this is not going to be public. It is private. It is in my home. I'm not advertising it. So there you go. Okay. So once I pull everything away that is old, okay? I'm gonna move it over so I don't lose my train of thought here. So that is all old stuff. Then I literally just transition everything in my kitchen to what is new, okay? And this is where it comes in such good, or it comes in handy when you get these, um, these new kits that Scentsy offers for the transition for the new catalog okay so I will be folding up all of the new product sheets okay the product list like I said these are a game changer they can write on these they can do whatever they're theirs okay I will have all of those folded up I will have all of the testers of the new smells okay I will have all of the bars of the new smells, and this is their favorite part. If they cannot smell it, they're more likely not to buy it, okay? When my customers can smell things and get hooked on a smell, and when they're so excited that this stuff isn't available yet, but they can order it, they can do a pre-order with me, and it comes out February 1st when I do that order February 1st, they're so pumped. So I have the 10 new release smells. Your customers want to be able to smell this stuff, guys, okay? 
So I have the actual bars. I will have all of these out for them. They're so, they're, they live for this stuff, okay? Um, I, I got the laundry stuff so they can see what is coming out in laundry. My customers love laundry. Why? Because I sample it out to them, okay? I want my customers to always be um, in the know of what is new coming out. So they love washer whiffs. They love laundry because I've sampled it out on purpose to them, right? Um, so we have laundry coming in magnolia linen. We have laundry coming in coral water. So that will be out for them. I have the clean kit, okay? Coastal Sunset. It comes in a lot of different things. Um, and I'll show you guys this in just a second. It coming, it's coming in a lot of things. A lot of my customers love Coastal Sunset. To see that this is coming in Counterclean, which Counterclean is something that my customers love. Why? Because I've sampled it out every time we have a new scent and they fall in love with it, okay? Counterclean Dish Soap Bathroom Cleaner. They will be able to see that that's coming, okay? They can use my counter cleaner. I don't care. They can use my dish soap. Um, <clears throat> I have gone ahead and worked smart. I did not use all of my washer whiffs. I have some that is still in the little container so they can smell it and get the experience so they don't have to open these up. But everyone who comes to my party will get Magnolia Linen Washer Whiff Sample. Coral, water, coral Waters Washer Whip Sample, okay? I just have them in baggies. This is nothing fancy. It's just so I can figure out where I'm gonna put these for people who do come, okay? Um, I also have sampled <clears throat> in our World Tour Kit. Um, we had three scents, so pineapple, mango, white, amber, and teak, and coconuts for coconuts. I went ahead and did wax samples for all of these, okay? Those are three scents that they're going to get wax samples of. The Valentine's Day scents. Those are all, I sampled those out, okay? I did wax samples of all of those, so they will also get these, okay? I just have them in baggies. Now, <clears throat> the way that this is gonna work is that I am strategically bringing this stuff out so I can go ahead and get pre-orders for the for February 1st, okay? So when the new catalog drops that morning, I can hop on workstation. I already have orders to put in. I already have PRV for February, okay? So get, see what I'm doing here. Last chance, I'm getting PRV for this month because this month is not over, right? And then once I get those orders, because I am collecting those orders before I bring any new stuff out, then the new stuff, they will have the opportunity to go ahead and place orders with me, okay? I went on the new catalog, I screenshotted it and I printed it off and I laminated it. I have a laminator here of all of the new scents, what they come in, and then on the back, all of the new um, laundry clean body. This is from the back of the catalog. I printed it double side and laminated it so everyone can see. Okay, well I love Pink rhubarb sugar, okay, that comes in the bar spray scent circle, okay? It doesn't come in anything else. So they can look and see. It's a cheat sheet for me as well. Um, but yeah, so it's a really, really fun way. Um, I also have order forms. So this is typically how I run um, home parties. There's order forms right here. Um, these are in Feet to Faith, okay? I literally just print these off two to a page and I print these off. Um, and it's just very simple. My people know um, how to, I mean, they know how to place orders with me online. They do that a lot, but this is in home. So I'm going to be collecting orders, okay? So the orders that I said, last chance that are gonna be for this month, and then the ones that are gonna be for February 1st, I will write up here, new catalog, okay? order going in February 1st or something like that. So I know, and I will highlight it. So I know that those orders do not go in or they are for the new catalog, okay? So what am I doing? Um, let, me, let me chat with you guys <clears throat> about what I'm doing for those who cannot make it, okay? So I have people who are either local or people who are out of town who are unable to come to my house on Saturday. So what I'm gonna do with them, I'm going to give them the same thing. <clears throat> it's 
If they are local, I'm going to tell them to look at the link of all the stuff that's still available right now, 10% off. <clears throat> and if they place an order with me, they can place it online or they can give it to me and I'll put it in on my end. Um, then I will allow them the opportunity to have a freebie from me. And I will also be sending them all of the new stuff, including samples, okay? But I'm working really smart with this because I want them to know <clears throat> that the stuff that's going away is the last chance, okay? It's the last chance to order. It's the last chance to Cincy Club it. It's the last chance to grab those, okay? And then we will transition into all of the new stuff, okay? I'm working very smart with this, and I typically do when it's a transition month because the month is not over until the month is over. So I do not want you guys thinking, oh my gosh, well, Amber did her last chance first glance party, so she must be sharing everything from the new catalog. No, that's not it. I'm sharing it with my VIPs because those are my VIPs. Those are my best customers. Those are my people who club with me. Those are the people who order from me every single month, okay? I am not sharing the new catalog stuff. You won't see me sharing anything on social media probably until the 27th, 28th, okay? This month is not over. Today is what, the 18th? We have so much time left. So I want you guys to know that just because I'm doing this for my VIPs or you guys are doing this for your VIPs does not mean this month is over. We have 10% off this month. Oh, I will also, let me tell you guys this. I also have all of the bring back bars. I will have all of the bring back bars out and I need to write that down. I'll have all the bring back my bars out for people to smell and to add to their club, okay? Majority of them have gotten samples in the mail for me because they club with me or because they asked for my top eight samples. Um, but I will have those out so people can actually smell the wax too. Um, <clears throat> lost my train of thought there. Um, but what I'm saying is that today's the 18th, okay? We have so much of the month left. So I don't want you guys thinking just because you're going to do something like this. I know we are all so excited. I am freaking pumped for this new catalog. I am pumped for these new smells coming out. But work this month. Majority of the catalog is 10% off. We have the Valentine's Day collection that just launched. We have the Bring Back My Bars. This is a perfect time for you to amp up your Scentsy Club subscriptions. If people don't want to party, then say, guess what? That's that's fine. You can still get 10% off at $30 and a half off item at $60 if you join club. Make that a conversation that you... Ooh, I'm so sorry, guys. Make that a conversation that you guys have constantly so it just rolls off the tip of your tongue okay let people be okay with not wanting to party but if you get a no or an, an ignore keep going forward and keep booking those parties okay <clears throat> um on my list to do today um i'm booking three parties for february it's a non-negotiable for me i have a list just to give you guys some helpful tips i went through since august okay so my fall winter uh Hosts, I went through my workstation last week and I looked at everybody who hosted hosted a party with me with a fall winter catalog. Okay, guess what I'm doing? I'm going to be voice texting them or texting them today, and I'm going to be saying, "Hey, guess what? We have a brand new catalog launching February 1st. Do you want free and half off for this catalog?" That's it. I'm not saying party. I'm not saying anything like that. And it's all new products. So guess what? All their people are going to be so excited and they're going to be so excited to see all the new products and all the new things that we have to offer come February 1st. So think smarter, not harder. If you don't have parties booked for this month and you still don't have your PRV where you want it to, do, want it to be, you have plenty of time left. It's only the 18th, okay? Have conversations, have conversations, have conversations. If you get told no or get ignored, keep pushing past it, okay? Um... Yeah. Do you guys have any, any questions? I have eight of you guys on here right now. Do you have any questions for me? Um, I love, like I said, I love doing these parties. I love because home parties are where, where my business started and where I grew my business. And I love seeing people's reactions for new smells. I love when they're flipping through the new catalog and they can see all of the new warmers and all of the new dif the new diffuser shade and the new stuff that's coming out. And let me tell you this too. So for the people who are going to be here 
I will be giving them like a goodie bag where I'm gonna have the samples out and I'll let them kind of pick which samples they want. <clears throat> or I might just um, have them ready to go. I haven't decided yet. I have about eight that have confirmed that they're coming. Um, and like I said, how I did that, I posted it on my VIP page. Um, let me find it for you guys so I can just show you guys. I'm a very visual person, so. Um, I literally just posted it. And then, uh, well, actually, when I was getting um, interest for it, I asked them if this, I did this a few weeks ago, I asked them if the 22nd worked better or the 23rd. I wanted to know if a Saturday or Sunday worked better. So I gave them two options. Majority of people said Saturday. So we went with that. Um, so let me show you guys, because you guys don't see this. Okay, so <clears throat> when I planned this at the beginning of the month, this is what I made on Canva. It's official, last chance, first glance. Boozy brunch is on the calendar. Come hang for some snacks, champs. Um, last chance to snack, continue, discontinuing since. Giveaways, like I said, this has to be private. This is in my private VIP page, okay? Um, and for exclusive sneak peeks of what's to come. Comment below if you're in, okay? I had people comment, and then I also had um, a follow-up post that I did after I sent out personal texts, I don't just rely on this page. <clears throat> now, in December, when I was about to go into a new year, I asked my VIPs, I said, do you guys like your communication through this page? Do you want me to switch to text messages? What's the best way? And they said they wanted this page to stay the same. So I just followed up with texts and I reminded them of it. Um, and then I also made a post. <clears throat> Last week, who's planning on coming to the party next Saturday at 12? Please answer the poll below. Um, I, I did either I'll be there or I did one that said I'm so sad I can't make it, okay? So the people who said I'm so sad I can't make it, I will be reaching out to them, like I said, with the link, letting them know that they can place an order, tell me the order or do it online. And then they will be getting the samples and the sneak peek of the new stuff to come. Um, so, like I said, think smarter, not harder with this. It's a lot of fun. Um, home parties, like I said, are my jam. If you've never done a home party, it's okay. Just breathe. They're so much fun. Um, there's no pressure. But, like I said, it's a blast. My customers love them. My customers just really love me doing stuff like this for them. Um, so, I don't see any questions from you guys. I hope this was helpful. I hope you guys have a great day. And like I said, we have a lot of time left for January. So y'all go out and kill it. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.